what's going on homies welcome back to another call of duty gameplay now today we're going to be talking about a little bit about black ops 4 and what we've got so far and i am really fucking excited for this game now the reveal trailer and like the reveal events tomorrow because i'm recording this a day before but it's today if you're actually watching it and i believe it should be going on in an hour if i upload this at one we'll see pretty sure it's like at two i, I believe it starts some, somewhere around there it starts at like two est of course uh, it's they're in pacific time so you kind of had to add the three hours so i'm excited to watch now i feel like playing black ops 3 is the most appropriate game in order to get ready uh for black ops 4 even though it says it's not going to be completely boots on ground but it's not going to be like jetpacks which i think they could really do something cool with that but when i think of that i think more of like an advanced warfare thing so like you can like jump maybe higher like you can like boost maybe once or you can boost forward which kind of gives me like an advanced warfare feel but we will see how they actually like do it we've gotten a few teasers as well towards like the new game like there was a hive camo there's a hive calling card and so far we really don't know what these two mean maybe we'll get some more information today i think i'm gonna play some fringe nightfall because i, I haven't played much of it i only played it in a video that i was gonna upload but um, the audio got delayed and I really didn't want to pull like crappy content like that out I mean, I'm used to crappy content, but it's whatever Okay, we're, we're not we're not we're not playing black ops 3. I'll play black ops 2 Oh, and also look at my games library because I got that external hard drive shit going man And I'm gonna actually install the new Xbox game of the month, which is Metal Gear, Gear Solid and Vanquish I probably won't play Vanquish. I might play a little bit of Metal Gear Solid because I know it is a pretty popular game. That's one of the games I probably will play out of all these. Like, I know for sure I'm probably never going to play, like, fucking the incredible adventures of, like, Indiana Jones or whatever the fuck he is. I actually have, like, two hours to make this video, and that includes, like, recording and editing, and I don't know. I have no clue how I'm going to do it. I'm gonna try to edit this the best I can, but also um, managing my time well. Now, starting with single player for Black Ops 4, I'm pretty sure it's almost 126% confirmed that there's gonna be no single player, and they're actually gonna be focusing on like a like a third game mode, which a lot of people are speculating is gonna be the battle royale. Which I don't know how I feel because I I feel like a battle royale for call of duty will will be kind of cool but they're gonna mess it up in some way like i said i don't know how i feel about the battle royale i, I i'll probably like playing it but again they're gonna do something that might mess it up or something that i don't like and that's kind of one thing i like about pubg and not fortnite it's when you when you run up on someone if it's a one-on-one -on -one gun battle if both people are aware of like that person being there it's on in fortnite they just build they just build and that's kind of it that's kind of what makes it unique but i don't like the building part i just like the whole gun skill part and i guess i can also be because i really suck at building but i i don't know i like that there's no really building a pubg it's more so just tactical or more skillful <sighs> no game on black ops 2 we're going to black ops 1 will i be able to get in a game on black ops 1 that's the real question if not i, I and also with the battle royale mode the real question is are they gonna include only the guns that are in black ops 4 are they gonna include the guns that are in black ops 3 are they gonna include all the guns that have been in the black ops series are they gonna include like world at war ones are they gonna include guns from like games like sledgehammer games and infinity war are they gonna include all the guns are they just gonna include the guns that are like in their game now how i feel is that they're just gonna keep the guns that are like actually in their game and if they do venture out, then I feel like it's just going to be like a few select fan favorites, like maybe the, the MA or the AN94 or the MSMC or some just like fan favorite guns, like if you know what I mean. I love this this game because like you can kind of get out of the seat, which is completely something that's like not really that cool, but I find it pretty cool. It's It was like more of the, it was like the first interactive menu that we've had and the first in like a while, now that I think about it, the only time that we've had an interactive menu was was world war ii because of the headquarters i mean it really isn't that much interactive but it's kind of cool that you can kind of walk around the, the menu oh this is my favorite loading screen and my favorite music at a loading screen i don't know it's just playing this on the ps3 like with my cousin it just it's so weird because back then it was just so new like it was literally the first year it came out it just looked so 
clean and it was new and it's what everybody was playing and now that it's i mean all it's really old i mean let me see 2010 yeah because this is the game after mw2 which is crazy because like when this game was brand new mw2 was the game before it and now mw2 just seems so ancient ancient and a lot of people don't play it or haven't played it more so i probably won't be able to find a game because i have all the dlc installed but I, I kind of want to keep it because it's more it's more so like the mo the, the mombi maps the zombie maps but we did find a game in jungle the vietnam sort of the vietnamese map i think i said that correctly there's another guy i might play world war ii honestly this guy literally just free fired me what do i do what do i do with this it feels so like it feels like a nerf gun but we need like one more point to win okay i thought so Okay, I really don't want to play this right now. I don't want to play Black Ops. So, I, just a few days ago, I believe we got like a little teaser, GIF or GIF, however you want to pronounce it. It was a GIF that like kind of showed a Molotov being set off, and then it was something else. If I can, I'll put the, uh, the actual GIF on the screen right now. We also got like a little uh, teaser towards zombies and it kind of looks like Treyarch is taking more of a, a scary effect on zombies, which they really haven't done in the past, unless it was more so just like Noct or World at War. They kind of went away from that scary effect and World War II actually attempted to do that. I'm going to be playing some shipment for sure because that's all I really play. I love shipment, even though it's the most stressful thing in the entire world so we got that one trailer for or that one teaser for zombies i'm hoping we'll get a little bit more in the reveal the black ops 4 reveal i don't think we will i'm pretty sure we're just gonna get mostly multiplayer and maybe a battle royale or maybe a little bit of confirmation on a few other things i know there was a when we found out the the game was actually going to be black ops 4 when we found like the files and gamestop or whatever it was um we found a little bit of World at War remastered or something with World at War. If we can get a World at War remastered, I think that'll be really cool. Um, please ignore my aim as it is my warm up game in like a week. Oh, the beautiful. Oh, no scope, dick. Bro! Oh, shit, flat. Sometimes I can snipe. Dude, let me get the camper! Oh, we actually almost came back in this game. I didn't do too hot. I was 7-9, but that's besides the fact. Now, I want to snipe, so I might get on a little bit bigger map. You guys got fucking shit on. Holy shit. Holy shit, man. <laughs> now, I did introduce my second channel, which is Dracovent 2. I will leave the link down below, but if you could probably just look up Dracovent, I believe that video pops up. But I made it, so I just mainly upload uh cut comms on this channel which is that's what i'm gonna kind of do during the during the summer and i'm gonna actually put videos that are not edited that are a little bit more raw on the dragon 2 channel so if you like the raw videos go on dragon 2 if you like the cut comms stay on this channel subscribe to both of them nonetheless i i believe you should do that but that wasn't even a bot i see okay i'll get you first I'll get you. I'm getting headshots galore. Stay on mission. <laughs> There's no way I'm getting back. <gasps> oh, if that wall was down, I probably would have made it. Yes, it took me a lot longer than it should have, but it's fine. Where are you? I saw you. Oh, I'm getting gassed, bro. I'm getting gassed! Okay, I'm, I'm most definitely pulling a sub out just so I can, like, shit on them. I hate to see it. Oh, you hate to see it. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, hi. I was about to say, I'm pre firing you. Let it be. I, saw, I thought I saw something coming up. I wasn't sure, though. I'm getting like targeted. Watch this. 
Yo, I'm actually doing hella good with this bar. I was literally holding one angle and I was sitting on it like a god. So I'm really excited for Black Ops 4. I feel like it's gonna be a great game. I feel like it's, I don't, I mean, I'm a little, I'm one of those optimistic Call of Duty fans and I was really targeting one person right there. That's why I died. I'm a really optimistic Call of Duty fan and I feel like every game has the potential to be somewhat good. Where are you, bitch? Oh, you hate to see it. Get out of here! This is our site! This is our site! I probably led the team! That's all, folks.